Angiodysplasia is caused by malformed dilated interstinal blood vessels in the lower gastrointestinal tract. The dilated blood vessels in angiodysplasia are situated in the submucosa and the mucosa. The condition occurs most frequently in the right colon, especially in the cecum, where the colon is at its widest. And this is the part of the lower GI tract where the tension in the bowel wall will be greatest. And it is thought that angiodysplasia is generally an acquired condition associated with ageing, although there may be a congenital component in some cases. Angiodysplasia is an age-related condition and it occurs with increasing frequency from the 50s and beyond. This is the gross appearance of angiodysplasia. You can see a little reddened area in the middle of the picture. This is caused by the dilated blood vessels. This is the histological appearance of angiodysplasia and you can see dilated malformed blood vessels in the submucosa. These abnormal blood vessels are weak and prone to haemorrhage. Angiodysplasia is the second most common cause of lower gastrointestinal bleeding in the elderly, the most frequent cause being diverticular disease. The bleeding is usually chronic and recurrent, but in 10 to 15% of cases may be massive. Treatment may be by embolization of the affected area or surgical resection in uncontrolled bleeding.